Hey guys, it's Lee with the Turquoise Valentine and we're gonna do a little transformation tonight on a Dollar Tree sign and I'm trying to get that, this thing off of my screen. Okay, there it goes. Oh, hey, there's everybody. There's people popping on, hey. I was trying to get something off my screen. Hey Heather, how are you? Okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started because we gotta paint. Hey Kelly, thank you Kelly for the sweet happy mail. That was so sweet of you. Hey Kaylee, hey Marcy. I don't know how that's on there. I'm gonna cut this off, where's my scissors? Hey Phyllis, hey Linda. I'm gonna just get start getting all this off of here so we can get started. Hey Melanie and Donna. Okay, this is just a Dollar Tree um, spring sign, and I took the part off at the bottom. But this is what we're going to do. Hey, Marie, thank you for the stars. Hey, Jane. Okay, so this is this sign. Some of y'all may have seen it, and the little thing is crooked on the back, but I took it off. But um, thank you, Judy, for sprinkling. Hey, Mavis. Thank you, Kathy. Hey, Rhonda. Okay. So this is the sign that we're going to do tonight. And Darlene from Oregon. Uh, we're going to, uh, thank you. My shirt, it says, do more of what makes you happy. It came from Amazon. <laughs> and I put it in my storefront thing because I knew y'all were going to ask about it. Um, but on the picture on my storefront, it shows like some tank top looking thing. So just click on it. It'll take you to the shirt. <laughs> That's just one of the choices. And I don't know why it did that. Um, thank you, Terry. Your strawberry patch is growing. Awesome. You're making lots of them. They're so much fun to make. Okay. Hey, Liz. So, I'm going to take this sign tonight, and I've already popped this off. It's the little sign. Y'all, some of y'all may have, um, seen it. Oh, Fidelia's making strawberries and ladybugs right now. Um, hey, John. Some of y'all may have seen this, but I just popped this off. I took my heat gun and kind of heated it up a little bit, and then... Put a little slider thing, paint scraper thing under it and popped it right off. It came off. So we're going to um, do something with this in a little bit. But I've already sanded this down, okay? Because, you know, it has all of this. It, all of these were glittered. Um, but I'm going to totally revamp this truck. And, you know, I had asked um, y'all today if you wanted patriotic or um, spring. Well, we're going to do... A little of both. <laughs> so, I'm going to do patriotic, but of course, you can do this in spring. But it's going to have a spring twist to it. So, um, not all is going to be patriotic. But I'm going to actually paint the back, okay? Um, so, I cheated. So let me tell you how I cheated. I cheated because I took a picture of the front with my camera. So, I'll know exactly where all the accents are. And I printed it off on my printer. So, I have it laying here. Looking at to where the lines are. Hey, Nancy. Thank you, Margaret. Oh, you made flowers last night. Awesome. Those flowers, y'all, are so pretty. I don't care how many times I see them. I still love them. I try to comment on everybody's, um, but I sometimes I miss some because, you know, that's kind of hard to so many people. Oh, hey, Rochelle. It's good to see you on here, too. Oh, you didn't buy it? Well, the reason I'm doing this, and I know some of y'all may not be able to get the truck, um, the reason I'm doing this is because I have a feeling that when Dollar Tree puts out their patriotic stuff, they're going to have a truck. So, uh, and I'll show you. You can also do this in this truck. Do y'all remember this one? If you have this one, you can do it the same way. Let me get it out of the way. And then this one. Hold on. I'm trying to reach it. Okay, this one. Do y'all remember this one? So, any truck that they have, you can do this way, okay? So, I'm, um, oh, you're okay, Tammy? So, let's see. So, I'm just giving this a coat of red paint. And this is really soaking into this wood stuff. So, it's not as bright as I wanted it to be. But, oh, well, we'll be okay. Hey, Vicki. Hey, Hilda. So, I'm just going to give this a coat of red paint. But we're going to zhuzh it up a little bit, too. Thank you, Judy. Hey, Carol. Nancy and Patty. All of my friends are in the house. 
I'm gonna hold it up so I won't get red paint on my tablecloth, which I just take a baby wipe and try to get it off. Um, okay, so I'm just painting, painting, painting away. Um, so, so yeah, I saw that y'all saw my little cart, um, that I got today at Walmart, which, and I'll be honest, I saw the deal on TikTok. I saw where somebody had gotten one for $11 at tick, on TikTok, and I knew that ours had them. They had a whole end cap full, and they weren't moving. They, pe they wouldn't buy, people wouldn't buy them, and I don't know if it's because they were $39 or what the deal was. But, um, hey, Nancy, hey, Kathy, um, I don't know. So, I've been kind of watching them, and they had the blue mint ones, and they marked them to 25 because I checked them one day just to see how much they are because, you know, there's hidden clearance in Walmart all the time, and they don't, like, really advertise that. So, I just kind of scanned it with my little app. You have an app. Hey, Vicki. There's an app, Walmart app, and there's a spot that you can scan items in the store. And sometimes it's a different price than what they have marked. So I've been watching them. And then when I saw that TikTok this weekend, I had to run in there this morning and get a couple of things. And I went back there, and they had moved them. And the, the sign still said $39.99. And I just said, well, let me just scan it and see. And lo and behold, it was $11. And I about fell out. I, you had thought I had won the showcase showdown on the Price is Right. I was like, oh my goodness. So I was texting everybody I knew to text. I put that post on Facebook right then and there on, on, uh, on, uh, what I, that I did this morning. I was standing right there by when I did it. And, um, I was texting my soon to be daughter in law, everybody I knew to text, like, oh gosh, you gotta go check your Walmart. You gotta go check your Walmart. So, <laughs> That was too good a video to pass up. I got one for a friend of mine, and I got one for me. Not that I need it, but you never know. But you don't have to use it in your craft room either. You have five of them, Kathy. Whoo, Kathy's got me beat. I have one from Michael's. It's the blue one, of course, but I've had it for a couple years, and I love it. I really love it. All right, let me get some more paint. I don't know why I put this on a plate. Why didn't I just squirt it right out here on the truck? I have no idea. Ooh. This is just um, red, uh, true red by Anita's, in case you were wondering. Um, this was really soaking in this paint. Now I'm kind of wishing I had painted the other side, but we are what, what we're doing. We're here now. We're doing it. We're doing it. We're going to make it work. Well, if you have them at your Walmart and they're still regular price, just keep waiting because they might just be slow to mark it down in the system or something. So just keep checking because I never find deals like that. I, I just never do. And I was just, you thought I had won, like I said, the Price is Right Showcase Showdown and won a car and everything else. <laughs> I couldn't believe it. But you don't like the color? You can always spray paint that thing. It's black, but, which pretty much goes with everything. But anyway, all right. So I've got a good coat on it so far. And I'm, now I'm going to work on the, you went online and tried to buy it online. Okay. I saw where everybody, oh, it's in the, it's in my Amazon thing. I got on Amazon. Um, it's really cute. Do more of what makes you happy. I had to have it. Let's see. I'm part of one of those, um, a couple of groups on Facebook that's called, um, bomb deals or something like that and they post like amazon stuff that you can get that's kind of inexpensive on amazon and this shirt was on there the other day and i was like that's a cute shirt i think i need that shirt hey stephanie from louisiana oh you just saw the carts and they had a lot of them and now i bet they don't have them because they went on tiktok so i bet a bunch of people saw it on tiktok to be honest okay so now i'm going to Paint the bumper. Let's see. I don't know what color. This is uh, graphite by Craftsmart from Michaels. Yeah, if you go to my Amazon um, storefront thing, is in the very first post on my page. It stays pinned at the top. So, um, 
it's there. And somebody ha had asked me this morning in my post, or no, yesterday in my post about my letter board that, I've, that I'm using that I just love. And I got it on Amazon. And it's in my store too. And it is such a good deal. That was such a nice set that I got. It's reversible. It has a stand and everything. And it had all kinds of letters in the box. The letters were in a box. It's really nice. Came in a real pretty box. Okay, so I'm just kind of painting my, where my bumper should be. I'm going to have to let that dry and do another coat. Okay, so there's my bumper. See? I'm going to have to go over it again, though. There's my bumper. What car do you talk about? Nancy, it's one of those rolling craft carts like Michael's has where you hang all your ribbon and stuff on the side. Um, it's one of those. It's um, Walmart had them for $39, and they've marked them all the way down to $11, and it's a $40 cart. And they're more than that at Michael's. Um, but it was just unbelievable, that kind of deal. Judy, if you'll go to my main page... And it's the very first post. It has a little bunch of little people holding hands. And it says, um, other places you can find me. It, um, it's all the way down at the, at the bottom. It says, see more. And you click see more. And it'll tell you my Amazon storefront thing. So it's there. But like I said, the picture for this shirt is like some tank top looking thing. And I tried to fix it and it wouldn't let me. So I was like, well, I'll just leave it. Because I knew y'all were going to ask about my shirt. But if you like tank tops, you can do that too. Oh, I'm painting my table as much as I'm painting the truck. So I'm just painting the tires black. Oh, welcome, Faye, if this is your first time. Okay. This stuff really soaks up the paint. I guess I should have painted the other side, but we're good. Need a little more black. So this is just regular black from Apple Barrel. So yeah, I bet everybody was like, I gotta go to Walmart. But I have, could not not share it with y'all. I was like, oh my goodness. People are gonna be running to Walmart like mad folks. But if you still have them at your store, just keep checking because I bet you they're gonna mark them down. Because that was a deal. I never get good deals. I don't feel like anyway. I always see all these people getting all these good deals at stuff. And I'm like. Wah, 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 wah. Okay. Somebody just posted my Amazon. Yes. Thank you for doing that. And I'm going to paint over this gray now that it's dry. Because some of that red's wanting to show through. It's soaking up so much. So the other side, you could always do the other side too and do it spring. Um, so you could do this re reversible actually. I just chose to do this because of all that glittery stuff on the front. I, even though I sanded it, it still won't come all the way off. That stuff's on there with Gorilla Glue. You looked online and didn't see it. Well, maybe y'all get lucky. I saw where some lady said she bought five for Mother's Day presents. I was like, dang, she lucked up on a deal. And that was my thought, too, was Christmas. If you happen to see them and you've got, um, you know, people in your family that craft or a kid going to college. My niece wanted one for her dorm room, um, which would be totally awesome for that. But she, they didn't, they already sold the ones they had at her Walmart. I was like, dang. She doesn't live here by me. Okay, so there's my bumper. And it's not straight. It's not totally straight. So, see, it's all kind of wavy. <laughs> but it'll be okay. And y'all, I got so much paint on my table. I should have put some paper down, but oh well. And this was kind of curved when I started painting it. And it's really making it curve now. It's like bowed. <laughs> so anyway, so now I've got to paint... This is the fun part where I have to kind of freehand the windshield. Where's my pencil? Here it is. 84 in Iowa. Woo, it's not, it was 80 here today. So nice. Oh, I don't need that much lead. Okay. All right, so we're going to do some happy mail tonight because I hadn't, didn't do it the other night because I was so keyed up about everything. Sherry Whitley. Sherry Whitley. 
if you will send me your address, I have one of these to send you. It is a paintbrush holder. I'm gonna send you that. So send me your address to my page and I will get that out to you. Hey, Cindy, you're okay. Oh, Linda, you're so sweet. I'm glad to be back on too. I had to take me a little um, hiatus there for a little bit, but I'm moving on trying to look at my picture and see where the windshield is. Now, this isn't going to be perfect by any stretch, I promise y'all, but I don't shoot for perfection. I just want it to look cute. That's all we want, isn't it? Okay, so I traced that. Hope to God this white's going to cover it. So I'm going to put my... Woo, I hate when the little crusty stuff gets on the top. I try to clean them off, but that doesn't seem to help sometimes. This is just regular deco art white. Oh, good, Helen, you got your bees today. Everything that I sold Thursday night, I think it was, all of that went to the post office this morning. So if you ordered something like Thursday night and Friday, it was so, it's it's gone. It's gone to the post office, packed up and done. Y'all, this is me. Is this? Let me turn. I got to turn it around so I can see it. Whew. Red paint everywhere. I'm hoping it's not. I think I'm just seeing the red through it. I thought maybe I was picking up red paint. And I am picking up red paint. <laughs> well, maybe after this first coat, it'll be okay. Cause you know, I'm gonna have to put more than one on it for sure. Yeah, cause my paintbrush is pink. <laughs> oh goodness, we're gonna make it work. Hang on and I'll show y'all my pink pink windshield or, or rear view windshield or whatever you wanna call it. Okay, look at this pink. I don't know if y'all can see. <laughs> It's on its way. Judy, I just scroll randomly and pick somebody at random. And if I've picked you in the past, like in the last month, I promise I'm going to get it out to you. I've just had a, a life event and it's crazy. So, <laughs> Edie needs an intervention on the flowers. You're good. It's not hurting nobody. Just make as many as you want to. Okay, Patsy, everything, if you made more than one order, I put it together. Oh, Terry, well, good. I'm glad you're here, and I'm glad you're loving it. There's a bunch of great people on here, and if you think this is great, you ought to go to the group and see all of these people's crafts in the, um, yes, Laurie, I'm going to restock the stars. I think, maybe I did. I think I did last night, actually. Um... All these people that are on here, they post all their crafts in my group, my free group. And you're welcome to go there and join. It's totally free. And there's so many talented people. And you're going to see so many flowers. You're going to be like, oh, I got to make some of those flowers because these are really pretty. All right, let me change my paintbrush. Oh, Kayla, you're sweet. All right, I'm going to paint over my pink. Maybe it's going to turn it white this time. Hopefully. And I think I might hang this on my studio door outside when I get done. Because it's under the porch. I don't know if it'll, if it'll warp. I don't know. All right. I feel like I'm boring y'all with my, my painting. Yay, Stacy! She got her B set. So like I said, some went out, they all went out today, the, 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 that round went out today, and I've cut stuff today, and I'll probably release again this week, and yes, I'm cutting more of, of all of it, 
Doria, you're going to be hooked on the flowers once you try, I promise. Because you're going to want some in this color and that color and all the colors. And you're going to be addicted to like all these other people are. Yes, Betty, there's so many flowers on the group page and I love it. Because just about time I think I've seen the cutest ones there are. It's like, oh my gosh, they're so cute. Just the color variations and the different, the daisies and sunflowers and patriotic and all this stuff is so stinking pretty. I mean, there's no wrong color. There's no wrong anything. <laughs> Kathy, it is, ooh, that's hot. It is a, it's this sign from Dollar Tree, but I'm painting the back side. Oh, I'm never boring, Carol. Oh, thank you. Somebody said I look good. Need the bag of polyfill. And Wendy, you haven't even gone and gotten yours yet. It's just a Dollar Tree truck. And I wanted to do this. It's just a spring truck. But I have a feeling that Dollar Tree is going to put some out for um, 4th of July. But it may not. All right. I might have to do one more coat. I use a different paintbrush this time because that one's pink. <laughs> and my water's red, so I don't think it would have turned out pretty white. So I'm going to just go real quick over it. See if I can get it not to be red anymore. Or pink. It was pink. <laughs> this stuff soaks up the, the paint a lot. All right, gosh, I'm still getting red paint off my hand, off the edges or something. Let me get it on my shirt. I don't know where it's coming from. Okay, so I'm gonna take a just a touch. Um, maybe I'll use that gray I had. Hey, Debbie, I am from Mississippi. I'm right underneath um, Memphis. Okay, so I'm gonna get a little of that gray that I used on the bumper, and I'm just gonna put a little bit in my, in the white on my paintbrush. I didn't even wash it out, it still has white, and I just put a little bit of gray. I'll tap some off. And then I'm just gonna kinda do it around the windshield a little bit, just to give it a little, cause you know how they have, it has the glare, and I don't really want it to be that glaringly white. And I'm just dipping back in the white and I'm going right back over it while it's still wet. So it kind of gives it this blurred look. So it kind of looks like, I don't know, glass, but y'all know what I'm trying to say. So I'm just kind of mixing, almost mixing the gray and the white together a little bit. Let's see. Just to give it where it's just not so flat white. Okay, so there's my, let me hold it at an angle where y'all can see. So it kind of gives it this blurred look. I know that light's bright and y'all can't see it, but it's not just white. Okay, now for the fun part of trying to draw this truck in. <laughs> fun, okay. So I'm gonna get my black Posca. And I want to show y'all something while I got this to this point. I was in Joann's about a week ago. And they had these Posca pens that I use on sale for $2.47. They had like an end cap. And they had um, all the different markers and stuff. And these were in there. And I stopped to look at them. And I was like, $2.47? Because these guys are expensive. They are very expensive. Oh, you know what I forgot to do? And I already put my paintbrush in there. I gotta paint the mirrors. Yes, Cindy, I do have a shop. Somebody will probably post a link in a minute. Um, I sell laser wood cutouts um, that are blank for you to paint and craft, uh, tear tray sets and just all kinds of little stuff. So I'm just painting my mirrors on. Forgot that part. Oh, Angie, you're so sweet. 
and I just dotted some white on my truck. Okay. Woo. So there's my mirrors. See the mirrors? Dude, starting to look like a truck now. All right. Let's pick another name. Marsha Dodson. She said sprinkle. Marsha Dodson. If you'll message the page, I'll send you one of these paintbrush holders in the mail for Happy Mail. Let me get back up. Oh. Okay. Let me go back over my mirrors. Um, Helen, there's new stuff in the shop is strawberries, peaches, lemons, um, the B set, of course, and, um, strawberries, peaches, lemons. What am I leaving out? Strawberries, lemons, peaches. I don't even know. Um, this guy right here that I showed y'all the other day, like he's three pieces. He is coming this week. So, I've cut them little boogers out today. So, thank you, Wendy. Okay. So, there's my, what I got so far. Now, I'm going to take my Posca pen, or you can do a black sh Sharpie or whatever. And I'm going to attempt, if I can get that going. I may have to do, use a Sharpie. I'm just going to outline my windshield with it. This is just a lot faster than using a paintbrush, which I have a paintbrush here to do it with, but I decided I'm just gonna use my Posca pen. Or like I said, a black Sharpie works just as good. So, all right, so see I outlined the, I don't know if you can tell it or not, but I outlined the windshield. You really want the B set. I'm, I've got more coming. They're coming. I cut some today. Um, Y'all, guess what I get to go do tomorrow? I get to go take my youngest son to get his driver's permit. Oh, Lordy mercy, Jesus. I survived one driving and having a permit, but now I got to survive two. So, y'all wish me luck. He's just got to take the test, but I just still have anxiety about it. Oh, Lori wants the scissors. I know, right? I, I'm working on it, I promise. Okay, so let me look at my cheat paper. And I'm just coming down like that. I just kind of went down on the sides right here by the tire fender things. See, I got my cheat. I took a picture of it before I tainted, flipped it over and printed it off so I could see. The B set, it'll probably be, I want to say like Thursday night probably. Because um, church is Wednesday, um, I'll cut some more this week. I gotta do driving stuff, um, driving stuff next week. Oh, you ordered the Posca pens? They are wonderful. I'm be honest, they really are. Okay, so I'm just gonna draw me a line for my tailgate right there, and. Then I'm going to come down, and y'all, I'm just winging it. I'm just looking at my paper and kind of winging it, because it doesn't have to be perfect. Let's see. So, we need some, some rear tail lights. Let me make that one a little bigger. And they're not symmetrical either. Okay, so there's our there's our truck so far. You want to buy everything on my site. I know, trust me. I want to cut everything for y'all, but there's just not enough time in the day. So on my tires, I'm going to take my white one, and I'm going to make just some little squiggly lines for like the little treads or whatever. And then I like to just go, because I just like it to be kind of whimsical. I'm just going to kind of outline my little truck. I'll show you. I draw like a line and a few dots and then a line and a few dots. Just to kind of give it a little accent, especially on the fenders. Well, I do it everywhere, but you'll see what I'm saying. It just gives it a little pop to the paint.
and I may have to go back over it because it's soaking into this stuff. And I can't draw a straight line for anything, so they're not straight, I promise. Okay, so see the difference how I did it up here? I did it all the way around, actually, to where it just kind of gives it that little extra, extra, extra. Okay. Ah, uh, can they be refilled? Oh, <gasps> really? What do you refill them with? That's the question. I'll have to look that up. I bet that's on YouTube. All right, I'm just doing some little, some more little white lines. This one's. Okay. All right, so I think I'm through with that part. Oh, you found the burner covers with the truck. Okay, so I'm gonna set this aside for a second. And now I gotta show you what I'm gonna do with this piece. So, it's it's gonna go on the tailgate, but we're gonna we're gonna jazz it up too. So it's it's gonna go here. But what I thought is I'm gonna cover it with some scrapbook paper. You just tried to sign it for texting. Hmm. I don't know. That's weird. Um. It does look nice with the outline. It looks lots better. Try again. I don't know. Text the word join or something like that, and see if that works. So, I'm trying to think what part of this I want it to look like. I think I'm going to do, see it's got the red, the white, and the blue, but I'm thinking, I'm going to do it this way and it'll work. Okay, maybe blue and red, blue and white. Okay, if I go up here, I can get all three colors. Let's do that. So, I'm just, whoop, let me just get it straight. I'm just going to trace around it on my paper and then cut it out, and we're gonna Mod Podge it on. But we got a little trick to this truck. That's not all I'm gonna do to it. So there's gonna be a little a little something, something extra. Okay, where's my, there we go. Can't even see my pencil marks. Maybe I need to do it on the back. Mm. I can't see the pencil. Where's my pencil? Here we go. Probably should have cut this out ahead of time, but I didn't think about it. I know I love this paper too. It's come from Hobby Lobby. It's paper Studio. Anybody upset because their paper's not 25 cents anymore? I am. It stinks. If I'd have known they were gonna change it, I would have went and bought a whole boatload of it before they changed it. But I guess it does go on sale but you can't go wrong with their paper. And they have a better selection to me than anybody. And Michael's, they have some paper, but I never see it on sale, ever. Maybe it goes on sale and I'm just not paying attention, but Michael's never puts their paper on sale. Okay. Put all this to the side. And we're gonna put this on the front. Let's see which way it goes, okay. Nope this way. All right, so it's gonna look like this. I love that, it looks really cool, doesn't it? Okay, where's my Mod Podge? Here it is. So I'm just gonna put some out here. Hope I'm not running out of paintbrushes. <laughs> just get it all smeared on. And that came from Dollar Tree, but you can get it at Hobby Lobby or anywhere. White school glue will work too. But I sanded this off. This had glitter on it too, and I sanded it off too, but it's still kind of raised. The welcome home is still, um, still kind of raised up a little bit, but it works. All right. Thank y'all for sprinkling. They do have good paper. They have a big selection of paper. If you just want to buy a piece or two and not buy one of those big, thick books for $20 or whatever. I miss the coupon too, Wendy. It's like, dang, why'd they do that to us? Okay, so here's my piece. Okay, so now here's my truck. 
Okay, so this is going to be the trick, okay? So I'm going to take Jenga blocks. Oops, just going to lose my piece. And I'm going to just play, kind of put them underneath this piece of wood, like so. And I'm going to have to play with it, I think, to get it to, to fit just like I want it. So I'm going to lay this on top. But I'm leaving the top open because we're going to put stuff in that part. Like it's coming out of the tailgate. Lord have mercy, I can't get it right. Okay. I've practiced this about 10 times and I still can't get it right. <laughs> yes, I do practice. I lay everything out before I go live and like, okay, this is going to go here. I'm going to do this first, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Okay. So I know y'all probably can't see it, but see how there's a pocket in there? So I'm leaving like a little gap. Oh, paper was 50% off last week. Oh gosh. You see my cup? Miss Dana, Dana Merritt makes these cups. She sent me pictures of all these cups that she's making for y'all and I'm like, oh, I want all of them. <laughs> They're so cute. Okay, so you can message her if you want a cup. All right, let's see. But it's a process, so it takes a couple of weeks for her to make them. All right, I'm just kind of seeing where I want to put it. And I think I got it where I want it. Okay, so I'm going to just glue my blocks down. Hot glue them down. Just like that. And the three, there is a space in between each one. But... It's not gonna matter. I just wanted enough to where it would hold it up off of the, the truck. Cause you'll see in a minute. Let's see one more. Okay. All right, so I'll hold that down. I know, what did we do before Jenga Blocks? I know, right? And the big ones, you can get at Dollar General or you can get them at Dollar Tree. I mean, Dollar uh, Five Below. Sorry, I'm trying to say. Somebody said they're at Walmart, and I have I forget to look. I need that cut for the for Nomen Backyard. There's my new friend Lee um, Lee Hanstein. I, I didn't know her last name. She has a page called Gnome and Backyard. Y'all need to go check her page out. She makes gnomes and does stuff in the yard, does all kinds of cool stuff. And I just found out about her. So if y'all are looking for a cute page with gnomes, y'all go check her out. Gnome and Backyard is her page. If you want to drop your link, Lee, you can. And we found out by chatting that her mom named her L-E-I-G-H Lee. The same reason that my mom did because she liked the way it looked on Gone with the Winds, uh, Vivian Lee. There's my cup. But Dana Merritt makes these. There's Dana. Yes, Dana says she just found her page. Yes, it's so stinking cute. Because she makes something that I want to show y'all too. That uh, I asked her if I could borrow her idea and make for y'all live. Because I thought it was so stinking cute. And she was like, yes, absolutely. Hey, Kim, you're new to the page. Welcome. Okay, so I got my... So let me show you before I glue it together. So there is my... Jingle blocks, okay? So I'm gonna just um, put some glue on them and then put my little piece back there. And then we're gonna get this thing all cuted up. Is that a word, cuted, cuted up? <laughs> it is a word now. Okay. So like I said, be on the lookout. If they put them out for 4th of July, um, be sure to, you know, look at the trucks. And like I said, if you have that fall one or you have that uh, Halloween one that they put out, because I'll buy them sometimes not knowing what I'm going to do with them. And I'll just I have a box of all those different shape signs from the Dollar Tree and I keep them in a box. Um, yeah, look, Brenda follows her too. Okay. Oh, your youngest. Oh, okay. Everly, that's pretty. Okay. So now we have this truck with our little 3D thing. And yes, you could paint those if you wanted to. I, I probably could have painted them, but I used the brown ones, those ugly brown ones that come in the box. And so that's what I got so far. Now, so let's, let's pick another name. That's your middle name, Angela? 
Okay. Angela Whaley Perry, if you will message me from Indiana, I will send you one of these paintbrush holders. Angela Whaley Perry from Indiana. I've never been to Indiana. I can't find the name. Lee, if you could drop your link, see if you can drop your link. Okay, so that's what we got so far. See how it's sitting off and there's a little pocket in there, okay? This is where the fun part comes in. Okay, so I made these today. The same little flowers that I've made before um, with this fabric. And I know I've seen y'all do some... Um, uh, let me move my paint before I set my elbow in it. Some patriotic ones. I used um, one of my little icing cups from the cinnamon rolls. <laughs> that's what I use for my circles. So that's how, I don't know how big the circles were. They're that big. <laughs> and I made the little smaller flowers, I guess. They are two and a quarter wide. Two and a quarter wide. Um, but I made four of them to go in my truck. So I'm going to put them in the back of the truck because this is kind of spring, kind of patriotic. So I kind of went with it, but think about it now. You could do this side and do it totally spring. Put you some springy ones in there and then do this side patriotic. Or you could do like summer and then do fall and do you some moms in there. That'd be so pretty. Okay. So I got to cut them off because I just took my, my skewers. See, they're still pointy and broke, broke them in half and did it. So I gotta see how far I want them to go up. Oh, Marsha, you're fine. You can always watch the replay. I'm just painted, I painted this truck from the Dollar Tree on the back side like this. And then I made my little piece that came off of it, stand, stand off of it with Jenga blocks or tumbling tower blocks or whatever you wanna call them. So I'm just gonna kinda whack these off so they'll go down in here. But I thought the blue would go so good with the truck. The contrast of the red. Well, I don't know if I need to cut that one at all. Let's see. I'm going to cut them down a little bit more. I don't want them to stand up that tall. Kind of tall. Yeah, you could change this up all year. If you wanted to paint it neutral, you sure could, Angela. You sure could. That's a good... Um, a good uh, idea. Where's my scissors? So I'm just kind of doing them at different lengths. And where's this last one? Maybe I need to put that one. Okay. Um, and I'm gonna glue them down so it really doesn't matter where. But I was gonna put this foam in there but I, could, I don't think I could get it small enough to go in there. Um, let's see. So, I think I'm going to put, I got some daisies here, some real daisies. I don't know if, I don't know if I'm going to like that with those flowers. But I am going to put some greenery in there. Mm, these are awesome. My husband got them for me for Christmas. They're Fiskars, and I can't find them on Amazon anymore. But they cut through anything. So I'm going to put a little greenery in there. Huh. Facebook wouldn't let you. They said it wasn't available. Okay. So there's... I'm trying to get them spaced out. Because I am going to hot glue them. I'm just playing with it right now. Thank you. I thought it would be cute too. But I gotta have some greenery. And I don't know if this is the right greenery or not, but I was trying to go through what I had to see. Cause I didn't want it just to be sticks. Just hold on, Natalie, it's coming. Natalie said, a little flag. It's coming. <laughs> she read my mind. So y'all know me too well. The Fiskars are awesome, man. They'll just like, Wah. they'll just cut through. Oh, no, this is kind of looking like little bean stalks or something. <laughs> bean stalks. 
I don't know if I'm making it worse or better. <laughs> Y'all have to see. Y'all have to tell me if I need to take it out. But I don't want just green, green sticks sticking up from my flowers. I didn't make any leaves. Okay. So, I went to Walmart this morning just to get these. These little flags that come in a pack. And they're back there by the craft section where in my Walmart. Where the office supplies are. And they have the flags. And so, I went to get this. I haven't glued my flowers yet. But I was planning on putting it somewhere. Maybe like right here. See, look, what? <laughs> look at them all fall. That's what I should have said. Look how stinking cute this is. I need to do them like one up high, one down low, like that. Is that not adorable? Adorable. Isn't this so cute? Well, the minute I saw this truck, that's, I knew that I wanted to take that tailgate off and raise it out and put flowers in it. Um, because I, I was going to do it, I had this plan before the funeral, before it, all of that happened. I had everything, um, do, you know, I had everything prepared for this, and I was going to do it spring. And then now, it's like everybody's getting into patriotic, so I did it patriotic, but it could be spring. You could totally do this different. Yeah, I was going to paint it turquoise, and I still may paint the other side, but, um, and do the same exact thing. But see, I don't really have to glue them down. They're just kind of staying in there because I got it so packed tight. But look how adorable this is. And these little flags are like four for $1.96 or something like that. But is this not adorable with this little flag? And I'm going to do something probably another night with these flags. We're going to do something else with them. Yes, the staggered flowers look better. I may have to... I may have to tack them down with like a glue dot or something because then I could take them out and change them. Like somebody said you could do it for the seasons. Batesville, Arkansas. I know where that is. We have a place in Hardy, Arkansas. Oh, the truck, Raven? It's this truck from Dollar Tree. So I painted the back side because I still may paint the front side. But how awesome does that look to, together? Just the red and the blue and the white looks so good. So, you could put, now I don't have the best handwriting in the world, I'm going to be honest. You could write USA, you could put Let Freedom Ring, any of that stuff. And I have, I have these from last year. They're like little rub-ons from Dollar, um, Dollar Tree. I just couldn't find one that I just liked, totally liked to put on it. But, um... You know, anything. You could do, if you have uh, stencils, you could stencil something across here. USA. But I'm scared I'll mess mine up if I try to write letters on mine because it's going to look, um, it's going to um, look all weird because I don't have good handwriting. So, let me tell you about this fabric. This fabric right here. Um, I saw some beaded, the beaded garland that Hobby Lobby has in the 4th of July section. It has red and white uh, fabric and this fabric tassels on it. Um, and if you go back to Hobby Lobby's fabric section, they have this fabric. It just has stars, blue and blue with white stars. And um, so I went in Hobby Lobby last week and went straight in there just to get this fabric. So I go back there and of course I go to the remnants part first. And I walked back there, and laying right on top of the remnants was a roll of this. It was almost a full yard of it for like $2. And I was like, score. And that's what I went in there for. Yes, Joyce, I could use wooden letters. Sure could. Put USA. The pinwheels. Oh, they're not pinwheels. They're cool little flowers that I show you how to make. Laurie, they're on my page. Um, if you'll go to the... Turquoise Valentine page and go to photos and click the little photo button and it'll drop down and say videos and there's a flower video on there where I teach you how to make these. And then if you'll join the group, the free group, everybody in that whole group has made these flowers. 11,000 people, I think everybody has made these flowers or they're planning on making them. And you're going to see them in every size, color, shape, form, fashion, everything. And they are so stinking cute. 
Um, the top, the the cardboard tailgate. Somebody just asked. It this piece was glued right here. Woo, I just lost some greenery. It was glued right here, and see, I popped it off. I just took my little heat gun and kind of got it warm, and then I took a um, like a paint scraper and got up under it, and it just popped right off. The heat gun helps it um, helps it to come you know come up a little bit. I lost my greenery somewhere. There we go. I'll have to glue it all. You can stamp USA with a stamp. Yes, that would be cute. My stamps wouldn't be big; it would just be little. What about for a license plate? We could stamp USA here on the license plate. That would be cool too. It was on the truck. Oh yeah, it was on the truck. I just popped it off. It said uh, welcome home or something in that glittery stuff. Um, so yeah, so that's where that piece came from. But let me give you an option if you do the other side. So these from the Dollar Tree, let me open it and show you. It's almost as big as this little plank is. So if you wanted to do the other side, um, let me get it out so I can show you. If you wanted to do the other side, get some of these planks if you don't already have some like this, or even some foam board would work. Um, but see, it's it would do just as fine if you had this piece. So like when I do the other side, if I do the other side, I'll just, I'll do the same thing right here and get it straight, just like that. So see, it would fit, it would work perfect. It, and they come from Dollar Tree. My greenery, I'm losing everything. And my flag, let me get my flag back where I need it to go. Okay, but that was so easy, guys. Y'all can do this. Y'all saw me do it, it's so simple. Just do your windshield, I just drew in lines and that was it. Mine is on a sidewall in my store. It's like, yeah, freedom would be pretty, yes. I don't have pretty handwriting, y'all. I'm telling y'all, it, it would look, it would be slanted downward and <laughs> I have the handwriting of a serial killer, I promise, it's awful. Um, yes, Holly, I have found good stuff in the remnant bins too. That's the first place I go to. Sherry Whitley has the paintbrush holder. She said, please pick someone else. All right, well, we'll pick somebody else, Sherry. Thank you for being honest and nice. Karen Cromer. Karen Cromer, K-R-O-M-E-R. -K -E Message me your address, and I'll take Sherry, y'all. And I will send you the paintbrush holder if you don't have one. I got a lot of stuff for Happy Mail. Yes, license plate. I need to do that. Why don't I just do it now? I'm just gonna do it now. Why don't we just quit talking about it? Why don't I just do it? If I can get my paintbrushes not to be pink, I think I'm gonna do it now. Oh. All right. Let me get it centered. It's gonna be a rustic, rough looking um, license plate. But if you wanted to do it just seasonal, you could just paint this part red and not put the paper on it or put a different paper on it and do it for seasonal and change out your flowers since everybody's making the flowers now. <laughs> okay. Oh good, Karen doesn't have one. So message my page, the ad your address, and I will send you one. Of course, I gotta do two coats. All right. This white, y'all know how it is. I'm trying to cover up red and gray. See, there's my license plate. Look how cute. See, just the little details, just a little rectangle. Yeah, the Turquoise Valentine's Crafters Reveal is the group page. And I didn't make little lines on my bumper. You know, you keep adding, you keep forgetting stuff. 
I got Robin. I got the D, the truck at DT probably. It's been, it's been a little more than a month ago. Um, not long. It's not been that long. It's since they put the spring stuff out. Easter, spring, all that stuff. Yeah, outline it in black. Ooh, mercy. That one's tried to get all leaky on me. This in the world is happening to my Posca pen. Had some fuzz on it or something. Okay. So let me go it with white one more time. I'm just adding as I go, guys. Y'all give me these ideas and we're all better together. Because everybody's got ideas that I don't have. And I'm like, oh, let's add a license plate. Let's do that. Because y'all are good like that. Oh, yeah, Anna, you got to see the flowers and go to the group. That's the, you're going to see flower, 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 flower. Scared if I don't get it dry, I'm going to... Um, Oh, Angela, you're sweet. Paint the tail lights yellow. Oh, yeah, I need to do that too. I don't have any yellow out here though. Okay. I feel like I'm going to burn it. <laughs> All right. It's not centered. So I put a star. <laughs> Can y'all see it? <laughs> My little third grade handwriting. Isn't it cute? But it looks okay from back here, don't it? See, it's not even straight. Okay. Let me make my A a little bit longer, make it look like it's all kind of level. That's too cute. See, it's the little details that just add that little bit of something, something to your project. It's just the little things. <laughs> Donna's like, I've seen flowers all day. I'm going to make some this weekend. They're too stinking fun. Now there's a lot of strawberries in trays. Yes, and ladybugs. So here's my, let me grab the strawberry. So if you missed it, um, whoop. Friday night, I make strawberries and little straw, you know, this, you can make them with different, they're circles, they're easy, um, just little fabric strawberries in this cute little crate. And then we made ladybugs. They're easy too, easy, easy. If you can do a run and stitch and cut a circle and you've got it made, that's it. Aren't they cute? Where's my, oh. And I gotta show these. You'll see Miss Darlene. Somebody asked me today how to get in touch with Miss Darlene. Oh, I got it pulled down over his eyes. To make the hats for the for the um, mugs. And she's also gonna make the um, she's gonna start making them a, a stitch or two smaller to fit the dice. So she's got that down pat. So you can message Darlene. See? And then there's the B one. My other B one's in my house on my thing. So so you can message Miss Charlene. Somebody asked me this evening about it, and I hope I sent them to her page, but I'm not sure. Nightmare Before Christmas flowers. Oh, cute. My friend got all the Disney characters for her girls, like Elsa and all that stuff. She got that fabric for them, and they're going to make flowers. Yeah, the strawberries are the thing. But look how stinking adorable this is. My little patriotic garden. So much fun. But now remember, if you can't find the truck, go to Google and type in truck outline or back of truck outline and hit images. And the trucks will come up. And you can literally just take you a piece of paper, lay it on your computer screen, get one real big on the screen, and trace it. Trace this out onto foam board. And cut it out and do the exact same thing I just did if you can't find a truck. But like I said, I had that fall. It's down on the floor. The fall truck, the Halloween truck, I have a feeling they're going to put one out for um, 4th of July. 
or sometime this summer, I feel like they'll put it out again because they always put trucks out every time. So, um, yeah, do you know, go get you some foam board, make you something, do make it out of cardboard. I mean, you might not be able to put it outside, but still, it's very cute. And this, how cute would this look? Just like sitting in the middle of your table. And you could do both sides and then have it sitting in the middle of your table on, for July 4th or whatever. So stinking cute. Ladybug turned out. Uh-oh, Ladybug didn't turn out. Did I pop the polyfill? <laughs> no, and I didn't even go by the polyfill when I went there this morning. I was right there by them, and I, I didn't even go by that aisle. I was so stinking excited about the um, about the cart. I was, like, so beside myself. Like I said, you'd have thought I had won the showcase showdown on The Price is Right. <laughs> so, yes, phone board, Raven, exactly. Or just cardboard. I know y'all got Amazon boxes. Um, use that. Use whatever you have and just trace out a truck if you even if you have one of these trace it out before you paint it and stuff and you'll be fine but if you just do google images and and do truck outline truck back of truck outline you got it so you don't have to have the the dollar tree um board if you can't find one so yeah it does look so 3d isn't it cool see i should have painted my jingle blocks but it's a little late for that no, trucks aren't going anywhere anytime soon. They were everywhere at market. And Christmas, they'll be right back at Christmas because everything Christmas at market was trucks too. So, um, do I sell these on Etsy? No, I don't. <laughs> I keep them for myself. Um, what's the new? What's the new item in the shop? Oh, this is what's coming this week. He's coming this week. Um, so see, I have he's he's got. His hat has three different pieces. His back piece, his hat, and then the hat has like a little belt with antennas. And then he has a little bee skeep and this little daisy over here, a flower. But isn't he cute? And he stands up and you put a little thing on the back and he stands up like that. Look at my bee in my, <laughs> my truck. Oh, look, so Christine, she has a glow forge, and she traced her Dollar Tree truck and used it to trace, to cut out on her glow forge. Your Walmart has a cart for $25. Well, hold on, because they were $25 at mine, too, and then um, they went to $11, because I've been checking them. It's Dollar Tree for the truck. It was a spring truck. It had, um, it had glitter and stuff on it, and then a little piece was at the bottom. Um, night Miss Patsy, and I didn't paint this side, I, I painted this side because this is kind of raised, but it probably wouldn't have mattered, even though I sanded it, I sanded the dickens out of it, but it's still, you can still feel it, um, but anyway, see, you could do both sides and make it stand up on your table at 4th of July or whatever, or do the other side fall or summer or whatever, but this is so cute, my little flowers. So I wanted to incorporate the flowers because everybody's doing the flowers. I know the bee gnome, and he cute. He's so stinking cute. Can't stand it. Yeah, there's um, Darlene. Somebody, Joanna has put Darlene's name. That's who does the hats. And then Dana Merritt does the cups. Sandy, I, if you'll get on my text thing, I send a text out usually before, I, like an hour or so before I restock. Usually it's going to be at 7 o'clock in the evening to try to give everybody in the, you know, on each time zone a choice, you know, a chance to do it. Um, but don't worry because I'll restock. If you don't get it that time, I'll restock it again. Um, it's probably going to be Thursday at 7 p.m. Central Time. But I'll text you and I'll also try to put something on the page. Ooh, a truck in B colors. A yellow truck? That would be awesome. A yellow truck with some white daisies. Oh, I can see it now. Watermelon truck on the other. Yes, Marion. Oh, my goodness. Yes. We could paint it uh, green. <laughs> a green truck with watermelons. Cute. I got watermelons coming, too. I just got to cut some. The truck was, Shirley, the truck was from Dollar Tree in the spring section. And, of course, now I've got to put, 
I forgot about putting my ties up here. I gotta do that. But wouldn't it be cute to put a jute and put some wood beads on here? I didn't even think about y'all. I was so excited about the truck and the flowers. Oh, Kathy, what other page? Her name is Lee too. Uh, gnomes and backyards. Um, and she does gnomes and does like flowers and stuff outside. And her name's Lee too. And it was just weird because our names are spelled the same and our parents named us the same thing for the same reason. It was just weird because I had saw an idea she did on her page and I wanted to do it for y'all. So I asked her permission. Could I do it on my page and give her credit? She's like, yeah, well, she was on here watching. And so I shouted her out. Y'all gotta go check out her page. Farm Fresh Melons. Yes, Nancy. One in a melon. Popsicles. Oh, we're all over the place. We're like, oh, we're just going to put all of it in the back. We'll have all the fruit back here in the truck. How about that? Strawberries. Yeah, even these little cute strawberries that I cut. Look at there. They're so cute. Look at that. Oh, can y'all just eat that up? That is so stinking cute. So y'all do whatever y'all want to with these little guys. I cut them and put them in my gumball machine is what I do with them. But look how cute they would look in the back of this truck. Oh. Yes, Laurie, I am. And I cannot wait to show them to y'all. So after the bean on rolls out, I'll roll out a patriotic one. Yes, I've already got him cut, done, painted. He's ready to roll. And y'all are going to have a fit. So I have to stay 90 days ahead of all the holidays. Which is kind of fun in a way. But in a way, it's kind of not because it goes by too, quite, too fast. Um... But yes, I go live every Monday night at 7.30 Central Time and Friday at 7.30 Central Time. So, um, yeah, Thursday at 7 o'clock, I think, is when I'm going to release. I should have enough cut because tomorrow i got to go to the driver's license place and take my son to the driver's license place. God help me. <laughs> what page again? Gnomes and Backyards is her page. I don't know if it's and or if it's the and symbol. I can't remember. Yeah, strawberries would be so cute. It's your summer salad. <laughs> yes, the wooden flowers. I don't even have any on the table. They would be cute too. So that gives y'all ideas of what to do with those flowers. Oh, the strawberries are from my page. I sell these in a set of eight. They're wood. This one's... See, this is a dud that I painted because, you know, I give y'all the good ones. I keep the duds. But they're wood. They're three-quarter three quarter inch birch plywood that I cut out on my laser um Donna I'm in Mississippi I'm right below Memphis no I'm not gonna sell my truck I like my truck yeah I cut out laser stuff and I sell so if you go to the turquoisevalentine.com there's a thing at the top that says shop my shop and it'll take you to my shop yeah the truck is from Dollar Tree that's what it looked like before. This is what it looks like now. We changed gnome and backyard. Thank you, Lee. It's the and symbol backyard. Gnome and backyard, not gnomes. Thank you. So y'all go check her out. Because I'm gonna do I'm gonna do one of her tutorials pretty soon because I can't stand it. Anita is called Bomb Deals. And, so, uh, and d discounts or something like that. But just type in bomb deals and look for groups on Facebook and it'll probably take, it'll probably pull it up. But they give you like code, coupon codes and stuff for Amazon. And um, I found this, you know, the shirt off of that page. Well, Wendy, they went out. I think I need to make the truck. <laughs> it is too stinking cute. It turned out way better than what I expected it to. Joyce, I used to be near Laurel. I used to be from Meridian, Mississippi, uh, which is like central Mississippi, and that's about 30 minutes from Laurel. Now I'm up at the very tip top about Memphis, so I'm like four hours from Laurel. But I'm very familiar with Laurel. This is the other red truck that you've ever liked. <laughs> that's so funny. <laughs> oh, Nancy, it's good to see all of y'all too. I love talking to my friends. Yes, it's so patriotic. I'm going to have to put it outside my, my little studio out here. Isn't that cute? We need Mr. Q to retire. 
I know. I wish he would retire and cut and cut. We could cut all day and all night. Going to Nashville at the end of May. <laughs> you love the smell of the wood? And see, after a while, I mean, I can't smell it. I don't know if I'm immune to it or what. But after a while, they it loses its scent after a few days. But I don't, because I, I can't. But I smell it all day long, y'all. So, I, I, and it doesn't smell. But I don't know if it's just because I'm used to it. I mean, when I go in the house and, and take my clothes off, take a shower, and I pull my shirt over my head, I can smell it. That smell on my clothes. Because I'm in here all day, which it vents outside. Um, but it's still, you can still sm smell it. Okay, we'll be praying for you getting your first shot. I know I haven't done mine yet either, but I'm I'm hanging out. Let other people get it that need it worse than I do. And um, I haven't done it yet. I'm scared. <laughs> you popped a bag at Walmart today, Nancy. Nancy's living on the edge. She popped a bag at Walmart so she could see it puff up of polyfill. If you don't know what I'm talking about, go back and watch Friday Night's Live where I opened up the polyfill bag that was vacuum sealed and it, whoosh, it, <laughs> it came to life real fast. Oh yeah, Joyce from the hometown show. Mm -hmm. Poly acrylic. Oh, okay. Just talking to y'all and getting some, getting some tips down here. Well, I'm going to hop off and, um, Go see what my son's doing. See if he's studying for his test tomorrow. Um, yes, Angela, I love my new space. I love it. Love it. Love it. I'm going to clean it up after I get it organized. <laughs> and I will give y'all a full tour. Oh, the cross behind me. That was a live I did before Easter. That is um, it's paper doilies from Dollar Tree. Yeah, don't forget, if there's a switch, somebody's saying, when you get my cutouts, it has masking on it. So you have to take your fingernail and pull the masking off or use it to help you stencil and paint. And like each one of these little seeds is going to have a little dot of masking. So peel it off before you paint. So like I'll leave it on, I'll peel this off, paint this green, and then peel this off and then paint this red. Kind of use it as like a guide for you to paint the sections but i'm gonna hop off so i will see y'all friday night um keep checking your walmart and make sure um um uh, oh yeah i'll check posca pins on youtube i gotta check it out um check your walmart for those carts because like i said mine were 39 they went to 25 now that i got it for 11 dollars. so y'all check it out because you might can still get it if you if your walmart has them for 20 you know for 25 or they still have them they're going to mark them down. Oh, good, Joanna. Joanne, sorry. Oh, there's enough for everybody? Okay. Because I don't get out a lot. I stay here every day. I don't work out of the house. So, um, yes, Susan, it's a separate building. It, it's my, was the pool house, but <laughs> there's like a space on this side that was a game room. And then there's a bathroom. And then my husband has a garage on that side, like a, you know, his little workshop, whatever. And, um, so I took over this part of the pool house. Like this was a pool table and a bunch of stuff out here for the kids. And so I took over this cause I was in a little 10 by 12 bedroom and it was, I was busting at the seams and now this is full. <laughs> so you can imagine, but I'm gonna hop off and I will see y'all Friday night. Y'all have a good week. And like I said, keep watching for those carts at Walmart. And if you're watching on replay, thank you for watching. And I'll check y'all Friday night. See you later. Bye, guys.